Hello everyone, Courtney here from How to Loom Your Dragon. Here doing an unboxing of the brand new Alpha Loom from Rainbow Loom. I was fortunate enough to get a sneak peek at this new product at the New York Toy Fair. And it's a really cool way to create bracelets with seven rows. Okay, and then you can use letters, you can make names and little pictures and icons on the bracelets. It's really cool and really fun. So here I'm just doing an unboxing to show you what's inside. So let's take a look. Okay, great. So it comes with a metal hook, which is great. The metal hooks are awesome. This you actually do not need, okay, when making it. However, um, I guess Rainbow Loom put it in there as an option, okay, to loom the bands, but you actually don't need it, but it's nice that they included this in here with this, okay? Great metal hook. Okay, here is the loom. Like I said before, the bracelets you can make up to seven rows. So here we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven sets of pegs. So you can make your seven row bracelets, okay? This is the new loom for, the, or the new uh, hook. Sorry, not new loom. This is the loom, this is the hook. Um, and as you can see, one side is full of hooks, okay? And these hooks are what you're going to be using to loop all the bands over at one time, okay? Of course, you can use this to do it one by one, but this is a new way to do it and get it all in there at one time. And then on the other side, we have these little um, bumps protruding which you will use to push down as you work. Okay, so this was definitely crafted by um, Chun, who is very mechanical and knows how to create things um, that serve a purpose. So this is definitely a great tool. Good job, Chun. <laughs> um, so there we go. And these are the rubber bands that you will be using to create your designs. Okay, they are different from the bands, from the regular rainbow loom bands, okay? They are smaller and wider on the edges, okay, but thinner from the top. Okay, essentially this is the same thing as a double looped regular band, okay? These are the bands you will be using to make your bracelet. It also comes with some clear bands, which the clear bands you will be using to keep the bracelet together after each row, okay? So you put one in there. Um, it's just to keep the bracelet together, pretty much. That's why they provided you with clear bands and not any other color, because the clear you won't be able to see, which is good, because you want to be able to focus on these colors in the bracelet, if that makes any sense. <laughs> okay, um, it also comes with some C-clips in there as well. All right. And then, if we just check underneath, we have the instruction manual on how to make the bracelet. Okay, and if we open it up, we'll see that um, there is a template here, okay? And it shows you exactly how to make each letter, okay? And then over here, we have some blank templates, so you will be able to graph out your, you know, name or logo or whatever you're going to put before you actually start making it, which is a big help, okay? I definitely recommend that you use this. You can always make copies of this um, before you start using it. That way you have a bunch of blank templates to use for each bracelet. Okay, and it's also marked out where the child's wrist ends and where the adult's wrist ends. Mine actually, um, the child's wrist actually fit my, fit my wrist. Okay, so that's up to you um, to determine whether you'll use the child wrist or the adult wrist. Okay, um, so I will explain exactly how to do this in an upcoming tutorial. Okay, how to graph out your uh, name or logo and how to actually um, make it on the loom. Okay, but this was just an unboxing, so I hope that you will go out and get yourself an alpha, an alpha loom. They're really fun. Okay, um, and yeah, so thank you for watching this video. And I hope you all will enjoy your new Alpha Loom 
and uh, stay tuned for more videos. Ta-ta, everyone.